structures around the volcano. Some abandoned outposts, some hamptons towers. Watchtowers? Avery was the most wanted man in the world. So if he was hiding something out here, it makes sense he'd need lookouts. One of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure. Fingers crossed. I see some ruins up ahead. Hey, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest four by the Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time, kid. That bridge there is what you would call rickety. Uh, this looks promising. Come on, come on, baby. Let's go, 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 go. Made it. Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. Hey, just keep, keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving. <laughs> ah! We're good. Everything's good. Jesus Christ. Traction here. Nathan, the rocks. I got it. I got it. Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of this. There we go. <laughs> shit, shit, shit. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my spine. Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. Hey, look up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Now we're talking. Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy at? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 four four with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. Going off-road. It might rain, might be muddy. I'll bet we go through this whole goddamn thing and never use that winch. On tight. Oh, gee. Shit. You take this slow, kid. Yeah. Sorry, guys. Well, if at first you don't succeed, let someone else drive. Relax, I got it.
There's a path at the mouth of that stream up there. And go. And no. That was a valiant effort. Let's go check out that tower. Got some big plans for this winch. It's in pretty good shape for something several hundred years old. Yeah. It definitely ruins from Avery's era. There. That ought to do it. Well, that looked like fun. Steeper than it looks. All right, ready? Give it a shot. Here we go. Slip and slide. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> See, Sully? Winch. Totally worth it. We cleared a hill. It hasn't exactly paid for itself. Well, yeah. Small victories. Yeah, well, I'll celebrate the big ones. Shit! Feast your eyes, gentlemen. Wow. Spectacular. Just imagine. You've come here, a well-to-do pirate far away from your oppressive government. Ha, <laughs> poor oppressed pirates. All they wanted to do was to murder and pillage in peace. No, no, they wanted to live as free men. Well, if you're gonna pick a place to run away from society, you could do a lot worse than here. Taking forever to get to this volcano. Patience, Victor. Patience. Do you know how those pirates got here? They had to start in England, sail to Brazil, then cut back across the Atlantic to South Africa. Sam. And they figured all that out with paper, charts, and by looking at the stars. Hey, you're describing sailing to a former squid. The point is, we got it pretty easy. Yeah. Well, it's still taking a long time. How would you look at that? Oh, shit! Stop! Stop! I see him. What do we got? Military types poking around. Nadine's guys? Yep. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Looks like they found an old colony outpost. But the wrong one, right? That's the good news. That means it's bad news. The only route to the volcano is straight through them. Oh, shit. You do have the drop on them. What's the play here, Nathan? Just follow my lead. Let's go, gentlemen. It's gonna be a hot, long day, and we have lots to do. Those Drake boys show their pretty faces. You all know what to do. We'll serve them right, too. <laughs> Just hope I back them first. How's it? It's all set up. Just waiting on approval. What's it? Hey, you hear me? Wait. Here they are.
Okay. Okay. I think that's it. Damn it. Rafe and Nathan must have dozens of guys out here. I mean, they, they could just stumble onto the treasure through blind luck. Jesus, these pirates really need to work on their infrastructure. Now, how do we get out of here? Again with the winch, Sully. Pretty handy, right? I wasn't against getting the winch. I was against getting ripped off. Slip and slide. <laughs> Sully, just how well do you know Nadine? Why? Well, I was thinking maybe you can contact her, convince her to call off her goons. <laughs> yeah, right. What if we promise her a bigger cut than Rafe? No, that's not how she operates. She's more... Look, Shoreline. Yeah, they're definitely going all in, aren't they? And getting awful close to that volcano. This thing in the same damn thing. What if they found the treasure already? Well, look, they're searching every inch of this place. If they'd found it already, they wouldn't be searching. Yeah. yeah, you're right. Hey, Sam, you don't mind me asking, how'd you pass the time in prison? Uh, you know, reading, mostly. There was this one guard saw me as a charity case, I guess. He had to check out books from the library for me. So what'd you read? <laughs> History, uh, especially anything related to Avery and other pirates. Just in case, you know. Sure. But you know, besides books, push-ups, smoking, trying to stay out of fights between rival gangs, it's a whole lot of thinking. That's pretty much it. Sam, if you had a guard doing you favors, why didn't you use him to get word to us? Oh, I tried. I asked him to mail a letter to your P.O. box. I never got it. That would be because the warden saw it. I got busted up pretty bad. Never saw that guard again. Jesus. I got my own back when the warden decided to room me with Alcazar. That didn't turn out how he expected. You know, come to think of it, I actually dealt with Alcazar a few decades ago, even before I met you two. Oh, shit. How are you still alive? Well, he wasn't quite the man he is today. Still working his way up the criminal ladder then. I sold his boss a few woodcut prints I'd smuggled out of Japan. 
He was into shoguns and such. Alcazar was the go-between. What was he like? Soft-spoken. Check uh, it out, boys. What is it? Hey, guys, there's another tower just over the hill. See any shoreline, Mercs? Can't tell. Well, it would appear we got here first. Let's uh, check the place out and keep moving. Drawbridge? How medieval. Yeah. Well, you don't put up a drawbridge unless you're trying to keep people out. Or protect something inside. <laughs> Up. The hell, the stairs are busted. There's no way up to the crank. I'll see if I can find something to stand on. sigil. So, do you recognize this one? I do, actually. Anne Bonny. Hmm? Operated out of the Caribbean. Thought she died in jail. At least that's what the stories tell us. <laughs> right. Avery must have invited her, too. The kid! I see a big crate or something way up at the top of the tower. Maybe that'll do the trick. Guys, there's a massive tower just past the drawbridge. Biggest one yet. Bingo. Sam! Special delivery! Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey, kids, you all right? I'm fine. You all right? Yeah. You got this? Mm-hmm. I seen a few. Are you two just relax? I got this. I mean, there's only one crank, you know. <laughs> Keep up the good work, kid.
get that bridge down. Let's try that again. Big tower on a volcano. Looks like the end's in sight, huh? But Avery spent all that money on towers. Would it have killed him to put a guardrail up here? I'm gonna take a look around. So just how much do you owe Alcazar? Uh, half. Half of what? Well, he only knows about the Gunsway heist. Which is worth 400 million. Right, but it makes him serious threat, and there's a lot more treasure in Well, you should have told him it was 200 now. You never tell your partners how much the job is really worth. I wasn't exactly expecting to be partners with him. Guys, we're going to find it, pay off that lunatic, and still have plenty to spare. Trust me. Fun, right? Yeah, well, I'm definitely sharing this one with my shrink. <laughs> Wait, you have a shrink? No, but I will after this. Come on, you guys are overreacting. Get the whole thing under control. Hold on to something. Ah. Ah, that was a nice change of pace. Yeah, I'm almost disappointed. Uh, uh, almost. Find our way in. Let's go claim our treasure, boys. <laughs> Can't get in that way. <laughs> Sam, give me a hand with this. Yeah. See what we got here. Huh. There's something back here. Sam? Yeah. Let's do this. Damn. Let's break over. 
All right, let's look around. Hey, careful with that thing, kid. Heads up. Ah, Jesus. I said heads up. Seems excited. Oh, he's got a lot riding on this. Don't see a treasure, though. Guys, coming. Come check this out. St. Dismas. We meet again. So, what do we got? More sigils. There's our boy Avery. Thomas, too. And that's, uh... Um... That's Adam Baldridge. That's uh, Joseph Farrell, and that's Richard Warren. Hmm. Pirate captains. All right, so maybe your pirate pool theory wasn't so ridiculous after all. <laughs> all right, so, uh... Let's see, what do you think the trick is here? You gotta push a button, pull something? Uh, maybe... Maybe one of the arms, or... Yeah, give it a shot. <coughs> Come on. Boys. <coughs> Whenever you're done fondling poor St. Dismas, I think you might want to come take a look at this. The trapezoid is obviously the volcano. The crown, that's King's Bay. We got ourselves a map, gentlemen. Hector, you're a goddamn genius. Hear that, Nate? Genius. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so if we're here, this tower lines up with Avery's sigil. Okay, so then the other sigils must be the towers from Avery's time. Well, I mean, a treasure's got to be in one of them, right? Yeah, but which one? I count 12 towers. Hey, uh, Victor? Huh? You didn't start smoking cigarettes by any chance, did you? Looks like we're not the first ones here.
Let's hope so. You okay? Yeah. yeah fine. Sam? Yeah, over here. doing? It's confirming a suspicion. Shit. Look at this. They figured out the towers, too. Locations, sigils, the works. So now what? Now what? Now we're screwed, okay? Because there's three of us, and there's God knows how many of them, and they have a head start? Yeah, but they don't know which tower to go to yet. That's great, Nathan, because neither do we. Yes, we do. <laughs> Look, it's a little worn down. Right there, that's a match. Yeah, are you sure? Because, I mean, it could be this one, too. But still, two beats the hell out of 12. All right. I'm gonna take this tower. You and Sully, you take that no, one. No, 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 no. No, Rafe's guys are all over these towers by now. Exactly. So if we want to have a chance to catch them, then we've got to split up. Uh, Sam, just hold up a second, will you? <laughs> Nate, he's right. These towers are at opposite ends of King's Bay. Damn it. If you run into any of those shoreline clowns, you call us, okay? 
See you soon. Come on, Nate. We gotta hurry. Yeah. All right, there's our tower. You really think all that treasure's gonna be just sitting in the